Meteor. A survival game, okay. You are a branded one. Let's have a look at this. You are a branded one. Cursed to a horrible fate and left to rot at Dernstall Keep. As per tradition, as you wake up, you discover there is a possible cure for your brand. This game has been cancelled. Oh, that's a good start. That's fine. Couldn't put it like that. They are all horror, well, allegedly horror games. This one says Evolving Fear. That's pretty spooky. Academic purposes. I'm going to have some alcohol. How about that? How about that? Yes, they are all allegedly horror games. Although, I do not guarantee any spooks with your coverage today. Maybe some hilarity. But again, no promises. Nice hand. Nice feather. Let's go. Turn that off, actually. Seem to be getting high CPU usage. Cheers. Drink along home. Cheers. Cheers to Meteor. Okay. Nice. What's going on here? This game's kind of loud. Hang on, a minute. I'm just gonna turn it down. Just a, just a wee bit. Oh, here we go. Magic. Press E to interact with objects. Give me the objects. Give me the object. Crafting resources. An item. You've acquired an item. Press I to open and close the inventory. Okay, we got a chest key, I guess. What the fuck is going on with that? Oh, Jesus. Yeah, you can sprint, and by God, do you sprint. Okay, can't go out there. Is that good? To execute this skill, you will need one alcohol and one stick. Okay. Can we get this? What is it? You found Selkie. Great. Great. God, the way you sprint, you, you certainly do. Hurtle down these fucking corridors. To run, press an old chest key while walking in any direction. Oh, now we have a stamina meter. Now what? Ow. Open your survival skills. Which one was that again? I've forgotten. Uh. Uh. Which one was. Oh, here we go. Splint. Splint. You got a fracture. Okay. One stick and one cloth. You got a flashlight? That'd be pretty good. I actually might be able to see some. The spooky monster. Do you think these are original assets? Uh, which one was that again? Torch! Oh, Jesus! What do you want? Oh, Jesus! What? What? What the fuck happened there? No, I what the fuck is going on with the mouse? This is a very peculiar experience indeed. Can we go in there? 
Okay, apparently that noise means uh, no. Okay, I get it. Subwoofer! <laughs> no? I thought perhaps we could, um... What's that disgusting sound? Oh, we're out of stamina. Who's this here? Well... That's no use, is it? God, that's such an irritating sound. Now what? What do we do now? Fuck's sake. Yeah, let's go. Well, that's interesting. You can you can move around before. Yeah, I know. I know. Let's go. go over here, play with this thing. Why is it so much of a pain in the ass for you to pick up something? Huh! Ow. We need to splint ourselves. Like splinter cell. Barrels of fun. What? This is a very strange experience. Whoa, fucking the mouse, they're so wacky. I guess I guess the idea is that he caught us, and we're now we're in now we're in the idiot jail because we are idiots. Keep it down in there, will you? Some of us are trying to escape. Can't listen to all this noise. <laughs> Hooray! Our greatest challenge yet, we activated the lift. Are we gonna meet a shambler? A bit kind of misty. Nope. 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 Not allowed. Can we make a torch again? Just yet. 
What sort of servant allows a complete stranger to simply walk into his lord's chamber? But, as I said, I'm here to assist. Make sure you don't die. Just yet. Mm, tell you what. You caught me in a good mood. Have a present. You've acquired equipment? Yeah. Present. Weapon. It's a very strange sort of attacking move. It uses a lot of stamina. And then we can fight our way through this sp spooky castle. Yes. Is that close? I, I get I guess so. That looks like a long fall. of this dialogue because I can't make it out. I've broken it. <laughs> oh. <laughs> I've had a few nights like this, admittedly. Um, I still can't move my mouth.
hit <laughs> my microphone, I'm sorry. <laughs> <laughs> Gosh, there's a lot of people want the credits for this game. What? What was that? What was that? Stephen Kelly. Adobe Photoshop, Adobe Edition. Music and sound. Psycho and Terror. Dangerous Dungeon. Monsters, Grunts and Screams. It's not a lot of people. You're right, Gumshoe. I noticed that. There's more, there are more than a, a few names in there. But it's the same three people. Yeah. We did it. I'm quite pleased with that. We beat a game this evening. I think I could be quite pleased with myself. Directed by Tommy. <laughs> I'm glad you... No, you know what, I'm fine. We don't need to see that again. So, the game introduced a crafting system, a system of getting injured, a weapon, and apparently none of these things came to fruition. Perhaps because the game wasn't finished. Although, it says it's an alpha... Apparently people quite like this, I'm just looking at the description of it. Now let's have a quick look at the page, because a lot of people seem to put reviews up of this. So let's just, just have a wee, a wee read at what other people have said about this. Um, hedge maze? What hedge maze? We didn't even see a fucking hedge maze. Shame that the game has ceased development. The game has potential for the main way to level up as a limited resource. It could be buggy at times, but past that, it's actually a cool game, an unsettling atmosphere, cool game mechanics, and the story was enjoyable, and I loved the unexpected voice acting. Um, apparently, people get people are experiencing bugs. I did, however, find a lot of bugs. Dying caused the game to freak out, and I went through walls. Well, yeah, mate, but did you complete the game? That's the question. I mean, what to say about that? This is apparently what the hedge maze looks like. That's an interesting texture for a hedge. It looks less like a hedge and more like polystyrene that's been painted green. Just what a hedge kind of looks like. Uh, the the mid-year speed running record. Yeah, well done us. Well done us, team. We did well. Anyway, I think uh, it's pointless trying to start another game, so I think I may just take this opportunity to... I don't know, we can have a wee blather for five minutes. That sounds reasonable. Let's look at some other screenshots and see what fun we missed. We didn't see that. We didn't see that, and we definitely didn't see that. We didn't we didn't even see this. Library. We don't what is this? We didn't even see that. We didn't have that. Uh what does it say here? New game button's not working. Uh how to delete save data. Transported to tutorial on death, infinite depth loop. Uh, there are two elevators. Elevator pit. Don't jump into the elevator pit, there's no way out. Yeah, I did that. Um, ho hovering elevator. Skills are in another language. The skill description is in Portuguese. Uh, do not fight any of the enemies. Even with the best gear in the game, surviving a battle is hard. Okay. Interesting. There's a whole skill system in the game that is quite unique. <laughs> is there? Is there? I wouldn't know. I wouldn't know. We just seem to, to, to just fall out of the world and just at some point the game ended. Escape does not pause the game. Okay. Drop unwanted items in the, the foyer main hall. That area is mostly safe if you don't bring in enemies. We didn't even see a real enemy other than that fucking uh, minotaur thing. Anyway, uh, guys, I think that's probably a good point to bring to a close, as I said.